This is where we say our vows, isn't it? Onto the big tree with the face. Now go. Take your vows. Take your vows. Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to Telltale Games Game of Thrones. We're gonna to, gonna to be starting episode three today. Dracaris, I think is the name of the episode. Either that or it's just a quote from Daenerys. And um we'll get a bit of a recap now as we jump into this of what happened in episode two. Because I'm not 100% sure myself on where the characters last ended up in the previous episode. So um, let's jump into this. And before we start, guys, I just want to let you know I've been a bit sick. So I'm noticing myself, my nose is kind of still a little bit blocked and a bit nasally, my voice. So I'm, I can't help that. I'm sorry about that, guys. But let's jump into this. Episode 3. Here we go. I always get this problem with this game. Whenever I click begin episode... It just goes dun dun and doesn't actually start the episode. Like I'm clicking it now. What do I do? Okay, after 27 clicks it worked. Previously on Game of Thrones. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men within your wall. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. I suppose the Crown could be persuaded to secure Ironwood from House, from House Forrester. Lady Marjorie might not look favorably on such an alliance. And it would infuriate Cersei. Although what would be amusing for me might prove rather dangerous for you and your house. Father. I'm going to kill you. Is that so? I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. Who the fuck is he? My uncle. Roderick? Roderick! By the gods, it is you! You, sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch the maester! <laughs> Let her go! Fuck you! You kill me, and the Lost Legion won't stop until you and your friend are dead. Alright, that's that. Noticing quite a lot of um, like frame drops right there. I don't even know. I hope that's not an ongoing thing. A while. She'll come back. If they catch her, they'll kill her. They won't catch her. She's costing us time. It's just that we need to get to Marine. Every day we lose here is a day that Talia or Ryan could be hurt or, or, or worse. You must return home safely, Asher, and, well, you, you have a history of putting your faith in women who may not deserve it. So what's going on here? She's scouting ahead. Beskit is my friend. You might be right, don't lecture me. Beskit is my friend. She's my friend, uncle. She's been at my side for a long time. Was it them? The Lost Legion? Aye. Too many for us to take. I counted about two dozen, maybe more, as well as horses. About half a mile down the canyon, and coming fast. Had to run my ass off to avoid getting caught. <laughs> nearly empty. You two care if I finish it off? It might be a while before we find more water. Ugh. Just let her drink Dying, it. Though. Nah, drink up. It's only a little bit left, so she seems like she needs it the most. Right, we need to get moving. <sighs> the Lost Legion. We're a hundred miles from Yunkai. When are they going to give up? Never. There's still war about Tazal. Yes, well, 
Perhaps you shouldn't have snapped his neck. There is such a thing as overdoing. Not that um, care about us all. I felt like it really. That's what I'm gonna go for. Got to trash it and I bloody felt like it. That neck was begging to get stopped. <sighs> You've grown older, but you haven't grown up. It's only a matter of time before they overtake us. Didn't they say something about us getting cell swords as well in the last episode? Oh, bugger a harpy. Like building a bit of an army. Can we double back? Not without meeting our mates from Yunkai. We're well and truly fucked this time, Asha. During severe winters, when the Skahazadan floods, it carves out great underground rivers in the sandstone. And? And when those waters recede, those rivers become caves. And those caves might hide us, if we can find them. I mean, we're trapped for the moment, but all I'm saying is we, we needn't die here. Just standing our ground. Beska, what do you think? By all means, listen to your uncle. If he's right about this, I may actually stab him. Right, we need to find somewhere we can hide then, like a crack in a wall. So, we can just, let's start off on this one, look at wall. I don't think there's anything there, to be honest, but let's just look at it. What do you think? Could we climb out of here? Pretty steep, Asha. And we'd be totally exposed if your friends arrived before we reach the top. Well, we can't stay here, waiting for your butchered friends to corner us. Agreed. I don't want to climb, I want to hide. Plan better. Right, I'm not really seeing any anywhere else we can go apart from that one over there. There's a corpse. No point looking at that, I don't think. I mean, let's look at it, actually. It's there, so we may as well look at it. Not alone. No obvious wounds. Maybe he died of thirst. Listen. They can hear water. That's water. I hear water. From underground. There might be a cave nearby. Um, alright, what can we do? We can look at that. It's a cave. Enter, right? I think I see a light in there. A way through. Oh, we couldn't be that lucky. Oh shit. It's them. Shit. They've actually found us. Come on. Go, go. Behind us. Nice. Damn it. Alright. We've got a fight on our hands here. Alright, they're gonna fight while I find somewhere to go. Fuck me. There's some dogs on the ground. Um, is there a way up there we can look at that? I'm not. Can't go anymore. Oh, here we go. What's this? Oh god, there's a beast in here, isn't there? Sounds like a cougar or something. Oh my god, a dragon? Daenerys dragons! Holy shit! Um, what? Retreat. I'm not fighting a dragon. Fuck that. Has it got fire? Where's Danny? Uh oh. Yeah, we need Danny to come and save us because it's obviously a hair dragon. <laughs> Dragon! Attack? No way. <laughs> He's gonna blow fire soon, isn't he? Yep. Talk. 
the problem with that, it takes ages to reload, doesn't it? <laughs> you actually gotta stop in front of your opponents and reload. Oh, Pixel wants to save. Fuck me. I know who I'm gonna save though. I wanna save Beshka because, you know, she. I think she means more to him than his. He hasn't seen his uncle for the, what, like eight years or something, isn't it? I'm gonna save Beshka. Hit him! Please be okay. Please defend yourself. Come on. It seems like he survived that. Is he okay? He's alright. Good. That's good. Yes. Wars with worse than this. Hurry, the beast is coming around. Asha! Drop my hand! Come Hurry on, get him up. Where's the Nares? She's probably miles away, isn't she? And there we go. The introduction to episode three. Da, 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 da. Um, I'm wondering right there if I would have saved Malcolm instead of Beshka. If Beshka would have been okay. Because Malcolm seems alright there. He's just got a bane on his arm. I'm happy with the choice though. Just wondering how that would have turned out if I would have made a different choice. So, um, we've seen this intro many times now, so I'm going to skip it. So, here we, oh, we can't skip it, can we? Yes, we can. No, that's pause. Never mind. Let's just watch the introduction. Or maybe I'll skip it in the edit. Who knows? <laughs> or maybe I'll just talk for the moment. Like, um, I'm expecting to see Daenerys in this episode now, because we've seen her dragons. So, and the episode is called Dracarys, um, with a quote. That, that's a quote from Daenerys, so you kind of would expect to see her. And we are in the um, the other side of now the narrow sea. We're not in Westeros with um, Asha. And I think the characters that we're going to be playing as in this episode are going to be Asha, um, the guy on the wall, Garrod, I think his name is, the, the sister in King's Landing. And I think that's about it. I oh, know Roderick as well, isn't there? He's in um, the Forrester house. So, the sword in the darkness is the name of the episode, not Dracarys. Alright, this is, is Garrod? Is that his name? I always forget his name. I think it's Garrod. Garrod, Tuttle, yes. Listen up, you sorry lot. Gather round. We're handing out assignments today. Assignments? Garrod. <laughs> we'll be men of the watch before nightfall. Right. Sorry. No hard feelings over that business with Finn, yeah? I appreciate you not ratting me out over the knife. It's nice to know there's at least one brother I can trust. Finn might have killed me otherwise. Just promise me you'll stop stealing things, Cutter. All right. I swear it. Never again. Well, no guarantees on potatoes or lamprey pie. Or for that matter. <laughs> Just messing with you, Garrod. I promise. I'll mend my thieving ways. Well, aren't you two sons of whores looking thick as thieves? This guy's a dickhead, Having a good he? laugh over nicking my knife, eh, Garrod? Men like you turn traitor for nothing. It's in your blood. <sighs> Next, yep. you're killing men of the watch for a loaf of bread. Finn, stop being such a bloody fool. When a man takes my gear, it'll be my fist that'll rip their heart from their gullets. You'll always be an asshole, Garrod. You're just a fucking craven. Oh, would you let it go? I've had enough of your shit, Finn. Fuck off, Garrett. Finn, leave him alone. It wasn't Garrett's fault. If you're gonna hate someone, hate me. With pleasure. Now, it doesn't matter what the world once called you. After today, you're all brothers. Could even be that the man standing next to you saves your life one day. Maybe you'll save his. 
Let's find out then, shall we? Casper to the builders. Finn to the rangers. Lobo to the stewards. Hugh to the rangers. Cotter to the builders. What am I? Ranger? And finally. Tully? Garrett to the rangers. Oh, Garrett. That's yeah. it. May all the gods preserve. We're a ranger. We're Finn. Well, Shit. <laughs> here we are. I'll be patching up the wall, and you'll be defending it. Should you northern boys want your gods to give a blessing to this union, there's a weirwood tree beyond the wall. Now form up and follow my lead. I think there'll be a point in this where we'll have to have a choice to save Finn. This, which is the guy we've just been arguing with. And um, I'm going to choose to save him just because I want to stick with the vows of like being brothers. And like, you know, I'm not going to not gonna go against him. No matter how much of a dick he actually is. Garrett, it's good to hear you'll be a ranger. Thank you. I know you wanted this. I'm ready to say my vows. You know nothing, Jon Snow. I didn't have many friends when I first arrived at Castle Black. Grin and Pip, they'd as soon have seen me bloodied in the yard than offer a hand. Now, I'd die for either of them. Our brothers are all we have. I don't think we've seen the other guys, have we, from the TV show? Pip and um, Sam and all that. Shows you what kind of ripe fools are running this place. I can't believe they made you a ranger. You're not fit for the job. You don't have any balls between your legs. Like it or not, we're brothers now. Means we're gonna have to get along. Don't count on Why it. Why are you being a dick, mate? Stop you it. You wouldn't even be here if you didn't have snow leading you by the hand the whole way. That's been nice. I'd keep an eye out for you if you weren't such an ass about everything. You don't give a shit about me. No one around here gives a shit about me. They wouldn't even care if I... Do you know how many rangers are never heard from again in these parts? And I'm about to become one myself. All alone out here. Wildlings everywhere. Or wolves. Or gods. Giant wolves. It's alright to be afraid. Keeps you alert, keeps you from being too confident. Like the next time we fight. <laughs> I'll remember how hard it was to put you down. I suppose you're right. You want a different assignment? Because I hear they need someone to clean the shit house. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's why I got so fucking mad at you, Garrett. You're the closest thing I have to a friend. Yay! See, we started that there. We started off the nice comments and now we returned them. I like it when people get on. <laughs> you handled that well, Garrett. They say the old gods watch us through the weirwoods. More than watch us. They know us. The gods are not forgiving. We brothers have to be. We're here. After this, there's no going back. This is where we say our vows, isn't it? We wanted a big tree with the face. Now go. Take your vows. Take your vows. This is the old gods, isn't it, or something? In the eyes of the old gods, yep. the night's watch offers you a place beside us. Now say the words for all to hear and embrace us as your own. Oh, we need to walk over there ourselves, okay. Look at that face. So, that's Cotter and Finn. They're doing theirs first. Am I joining them? Yeah, okay. Right. This is all the vows, isn't it? Hear my words and be bear witness to my vow. Night gathers, and now my watch begins. Hear my, my words. words. 
and bear witness to my vow. Night gathers, and now my watch begins. Haha, <laughs> let's say it. It shall not end until my... I click it and he speaks it, okay. I shall take no wife. I shall take no wife. I'm behind on the, on the speaking. Father no children. I shall wear no crowns. I shall wear no crowns. And win no glory. I shall live. I shall live and die at my post. I am the sword. I am the sword in the darkness. I am the watcher on the walls. I am the shield that guards the realms of men. I pledge my life and honor to the Night's Watch for this night and all the nights to come. I don't know what it is, but he didn't say it as well as Jon Snow did. <laughs> you knelt as boys. Rise now as men of the Night's Watch. We're gonna hug it out now. To your new family, Garrett. Give us a hug. Oh, a handshake. Oh. All right, guys. We're gonna end the first part of this episode there. We've said our vows. We've seen a bit of an introduction with Asher, and seen one of the Daener Daenerys as dragons. So. Thanks for watching guys and we'll continue this in the next part. So, see you next time. Bye!